<laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Get on back up in here, y'all. Good morning. Well, I don't like saying that. We say Grand Rising, Supreme Grand Rising. Y'all know what's up with the Grand Risings. If you don't, you need to understand some things about that English language that we be using, man. The English language got some things wrong, and I'm trying to adjust this. I'm feeling this tripod, y'all. I'm feeling it. It's nice. It's very, very nice. Especially after that thing I had from the dollar below, five below, whatever it is. It was below the standards of it should be on the shelf, that thing. And it's, I had it for a long time. I was just sitting here. But, you know, when I started doing it, I said, let me put this thing up on here. So I'm using it. And that thing gave way. <laughs> after all these videos, it gave way. Like I said, that leg was fluttering. It was hanging off. And it, please help me, please. Anyway, So anyway, we're going to get back on this marijuana thing. But again... With the W, 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 double mint. <laughs> Let me stop. The W, you are a holy watcher, baby. You're a holy watcher. You ain't no, this ain't no M. This ain't no M. Nah, nah. This is a mark of the holy watcher. Think, listen, remember them series, the movies, the prophecy about them angels fighting and stuff? It was kind of devilish, but listen, they dropped some knowledge up in the, the, the first three ones. I didn't get into all them four, five, six, or sevens. But yeah, them first three ones was pretty deep. When them angels dropped down there and they was fighting around here and messing with the humans and putting, and stealing people's souls, sucking it right out of them. That reminds me of that kid's cartoon, the Disney, it's not a cartoon, the Disney movie, them hocus pocuses, when them witches is sucking the life out of them kids. Ain't that like that Acrone? Mm, 2319 and that Monsters Incorporated, that A whatever number, you know them, they be dropping them bombs on the right in your face and playing in our face. Oh, it gets deep. We know it gets deep. And we know the times we're living in, so you, you can't afford to ignore these things. So let's get with it. Let's go on and finish up on marijuana. I'm over here jumping the subject to subject because it's so, it is exciting in a way, but you know, I know things get frightening and all that. But like I said in the other video, y'all stop paying attention to all the spooky stuff people are showing you if it frightens you. Because like I said, the whole goal of this mission God has set forth in our lives now is to clean up. The temple, we got to clean the temple. There's no way around it. Jesus, Yahushua Mashiach, the teachings of him are basically the same teachings that come from all the mastery schools and all that stuff. That stuff is true. He went to Egypt. He was up there in, 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 in uh, Tibet. He went with the masters. He sat down with them. He got all that education. Let me tell you something. And then he was gifted. In the jo he had the job to come back, you know, to his homeland and everything and do the healing and do all the stuff, the mission that he had he had to do it he did it and it was to make sure that some one day everybody was going to wake up and then come into the knowledge and then they all would be able to return to our father the prime creator the heavenly cult. listen abba adonai you call him what you want yahuwah listen he's the holy prime creator the divine okay and he is sending out all these messages that he got his people down here he ain't playing with satan he got armies down here he got us getting ready and you're part of the plan that's what this is all about Okay, so we got to get to it. Ain't nothing to do, nothing but to do it, do it, do it. Like I said, ain't nothing but to, and it's not hard like you think. Don't watch this thinking she's here or so other people are above me. Stop listening to this thing. Don't let other people intimidate you. You got gifts inside you, and we about to bring them out and do what it do. Okay, holy watcher, come on with it. Let's get it. Okay, so in regards to marijuana, when it comes to us, okay, so let me tell you something. <laughs> that so so so. I went out to a dinner with my niece. We were going, no, we're going, we're planning on going to this big old party, um, not to celebrate Christmas, but to see Frankie Beverly it's for that. So anyway, like I said, I was eating all that food because I took CBD oil before I left the house. Now the man I went and got the CBD oil for, I was re recommended to him because I knew CBD oil can heal you, but I was look, I told him to give me the kind without the HCT. Dude gave me the one with the Delta, whatever his thing is in it. And, and that's HCT. It's a child I was eating, eating. I could barely, I, I don't even remember how I got home. Like the third I kicked in and drove my butt home. I was like out, <clears throat> full of food, 
had a little taste of something, you know, some blue Hawaii for my birthday, just half drink the whole thing. I don't mess with that stuff. You know, I got one kidney on ice, so let me just a sip for it, you know. And I don't even be celebrating birthday neither. But, you know, it was like, I said, don't do She had cake and stuff brought up. I said, I don't want none of that. I don't do the ritual thing. No, no, no. But thank you. You know, I love it and all that. So we had a good time. Anyway, the, 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 the CBD oil can heal your body if it has, without the tea. Listen, there's kids with autism, people with medical, all kinds of pain in their body and stuff. They get relief and they heal from that CBD oil, so it's, it's beneficial, and you just, you cannot approach nobody in the hood that been smoking for years and tell them marijuana's bad, they'll tell you, listen, ain't nothing wrong with a little bit of marijuana, let me tell you something, let me tell you something, I got something to tell you, marijuana with the chosen, think of that rapper Lil Wayne, he gets on that mic, and he's spitting them rhymes, and they just be flowing. You ever see him? There's videos of him flowing, and they're they exuded. You listen. <laughs> listen to me now. I went on a trip to New York with my, my, my niece and my son. And we all went up in there, and then, you know, they smoking stuff. So they just, and we all had a little something, something. Just a few years back, and I was like, screw it. You know, I'm bored. It starts to get a little zooty, too. So he put in some little wink. I can't control the stereo. I can't stand that. Listen, when I'm in my car, don't you touch my stereo. You know how Chris Tucker, don't you ever touch a black person's stereo in they ride. Listen, it's not my ride. I had no choice but to listen to all that rap my son listens to. So I'm listening to this little wink, and he just, and tell me, you know how they get down that different. Oh, I guess that was not ready. <laughs> this um thing I'm a jig. What you call it? Ooh, it wet my phone. Hold on, y'all. So anyway. Oh, okay. Here, we're back. Ah! It wet it all up. So anyway, when little Wayne raps, this is what I have to say. When Lil Wayne raps, that he's on that marijuana. <laughs> Ain't no doubt about it. And when he's on that stuff, it brings some kind of, it brings clarity in there. Listen, I smoked it before. I know what it can do. It can, listen, you get on stage and you can perform miracles. And that is how and why many performers get involved in messing with drugs before they perform. And they get used to that. Okay, it worked last time. It did so good. And I was flowing. I was, ooh, it was coming out like flowing like butter. So they do it. They start dabbling. And then that's, because you get a sharpness, you get a clarity and um, talents and your abilities. It does that especially with the chosen it like enhances everything but you have to be careful listen listen to me now listen overuse overuse can cause the opposite effect negative like the overeating people he he ha ha you know i had the munchies and i was tearing up the food no big deal right okay but you do it on a regular basis so you're gonna become two ton lizzie or whatever you know that girl they call her Liz lizzo i thought that was funny she has that name but then you think about two ton lizzie why would you want that name as your stage name but anyway so it also dulls the sharpness with because of overuse after time. It dulls your focus sometimes. You could get in a car accident, but sometimes that third eye kicks in, like I said, and drive you behind home. So but your sleep cycles could be interrupted when you oversleep and you just you walking around in that fog, you know, your eyes are red, but you're still conscious because it makes your third eye kind of kick in. But I'm telling you, there are times where your alertness is gone. So, you know, why do you think they legalized it? They didn't legalize it because you, they finally going to admit of all the good qualities and stuff it has. They legalize it because they're going to make some money off of it. Not only that, they're doing things to it, if you know what I'm saying. Listen, they putting... Listen, I'm, all I'm going to say is, listen, the way it used to be, when it was illegal, I think it was better that way because... You, you, where you got it from, you was better off with the streets and stuff, the way people, they had it, you know. We didn't have to worry about this fentanyl, s s sneaking it in there, chemicals and stuff, or whatever the heck. But anyway, I see this is going to be another episode, and that's cool. I'm sorry that the phone did the thing. It felt like the um new tripod that is on, it has a ball back thing that you stick the um thing in where the phone holds up. 
And what it is, is, you know, in front of the light. And what it is, is that I got to get used to it because it moving this way, this way, tilting it and all that stuff could cause it to lean forward and pow, you know, that's what just happened. But anyway, we're going to get into the next one and keep on with this thing. I got coffee all over my arm, messed with my good cup of coffee. My mushrooms was all in there anyway. <laughs> I'll see y'all in a few minutes. Come on back because we're going to get into all the celebrities that it's affected and the ones that died and stuff.